Welcome back to Disabled and Prepping, and I got a chance to get out to the discount store, which is called Munchies. <laughs> and I started off with Munchies. So, I got, so I picked up some Benito's uh, sea salt chips for the salsa that I still have. Um, I was supposed to get $4 back from the chips that I got from the last pickup of things um because they just there was something not right about them and they didn't taste good so um they said no problem um so i was supposed to get that don't know if i did i forgot to talk to the lady about it but anyways um and then i picked up some white chips with a touch of lime those looked good and then i got Oh, um, sorry. The chips were two for three, both of them, I, I think. Um, the other, the Benitos didn't have a price tag on, so I'm assuming since they're about the same size that they were the same, you know, two for three. So that's what those were. These were, um, four for five. So they're original pork beef sausage bites. Um, again, I'm just trying to get more proteins in. I lost a few canning jars seeing that the seals popped. Um, so I'm start trying to get more different kinds of proteins, shelf stable kind of things. So I picked up um, eight of these, and they were four for five a piece. So I picked up a bunch of those, um, and then let's see. I'll get this bag over here. Sorry, she loaded me with a couple of bags, and then oh shoot, I just undid it all. All right. Well, I'll pull a few of these out. I picked up um, several of these. They were three for two, and I think I picked up uh, three groups of them. So I know I at least have over seven, and I think I picked up three more after that. Um, so that's what I got. I figured um, they would make a little... They're always really good with my coffee in the morning. I love them. And I found that um, I really do like the bigger ones, but they seem to have the little ones in a lot. So that's cool, too. Um, but, yeah, so that's all that's in here. So I'm just going to toss that over. I picked up um, two of the Juicy Juice. 100% um, juice. The orange... Ooh, sorry about my camera. It was focusing. Orange tangerine. I mixed with my kombucha. So I got two of those, um, cause I gotta start working on getting kombucha going. Um, and I always end up overbrewing it. So, uh, and then I picked up two things of wheat thins for two for four. I love wheat thins. Um, and I still have summer, uh, some summer sausage from the Dollar Tree. So I'm going to be trying to, um, pick up more of this later on in the season. For over the winter because I'm going to be picking up more of the summer sausage in fall from the Dollar Tree because that was really nice to have during the winter as well. So, um, but those are going to be for now and whenever, you know, kind of use them as I need them kind of thing. She packed everything in plastic bags this time and then in my duffel bag. So, you're going to hear a lot of crinkling, so I'm sorry about that. Um, I picked up a few... Now, I should not go in there hungry. Um, <laughs> I did, unfortunately. So, we got a lot of snackums and sweets this time, but don't worry, I won't be eating them all at once. Um, they're going to be spread out quite a while. These are in Mylar, so that's really nice. Uh, they were two for three for the Honey Stingers mini waffles, and um, they look really good. I think I've tried these from, um, but a bigger version of it from uh the second chance store but i can't get there anymore um so i guess these are vanilla f flavored um mini honey stinger waffles so um they're in mylar so it should last for quite a while especially with all that honey on them but they were two for three picked up those i picked up oh i don't, I don't want i tried this i picked up just one it's a dollar. They had a bunch of them, but they're um, beans with lime and garlic as a snack. They're not dried. They're actually um, 
kind of like they have like the olive packets like this. So I picked it up to give it a try. I was going to try to snack on them on the way back, but she buried them in the bottom of the duffel bag. So I have that. Uh, they're gluten-free, non-GMO, vegan, um, fresh alternative to dry snacks. There's 20 calories. Let's see. Oh, it's a uh, 1.76 ounce, 50 grams for a buck. Uh... Best Buy is 210 of 24, so they're still, you know, within that date. And we all know some products stay past that. It is a product of per Peru. Sorry, my tongue got tied there for a minute. So, uh, 20 calories. There is 140 milligrams of sodium, so that's pretty high. And less than um, total sugars, less than 1 gram. None added one gram of protein. Um, and if you can see that, that's the rest of the nutritional facts of that. Um, I did pick up some fried rice. Um, they didn't have two of them, or I would have picked it up just as a different way of having some of my rice. Um, so they adjusted the price because it was two for three fifty. Let's see. Oh, and I picked these up to go with my coffee in the morning um, so I can vary different things because I'm not really too hungry. But um, these you put over your coffee and the heat from your coffee warms them up a little bit. And um, the authentic Dutch Stroop waffles. If I said that right, I'm not sure. Eight soft toasted waffles filled with honey, cinnamon, and real bourbon vanilla. So that sounds really good. They are honey flavored. So I'll try those off and on with whatever. And I picked up four of these pretzel um, Reese's because I'm supposed to be having a friend come over. She really loves Reese's. So that is a snack for possibly tomorrow if she shows up um and then i picked up some more beef jerky kind of things or sausages this one's smoked sausage old old-fashioned um little beef sticks they were 550 but i got 12 ounces so um i was just looking for the most um protein in the packs that they have there so that's what I ended up getting um, and then I got some Cattleman's Cut Beef Jerky hardwood smoked um, original flavor and it's 10 ounces but I figured that maybe I could um, also use this in like ramen and stuff like that I just shred it into little pieces you know and let it sit in there while the noodles are cooking and stuff like that whatever or I can use it just for extra proteins. Looks pretty good. Um, I'm excited to give it a try. And let's open the next bag. Let's see what we got. Oh yeah, I'm excited for this. Um, I picked up some homestyle, oh, honest earth homestyle mashed sweet potatoes. Two for three. And it's already mashed up, ready to go. I just have to Ready to heat 60 seconds. Microwave pouch. So that is awesome. Until I can get some fresh ones from the farmer's market maybe. Which hasn't started yet. Um, I did pick up some corn on the cob. Chipotle Parmesan seasoning. I picked up two of them because it was two for $1.50. And I'm expecting to like this. So, hopefully I do. There's supposed to be two. I'm going to eventually find it. Oh, I did pick up two of the fried rice. So, there's the other one. And then, my aunt said I should try some monk fruit um, sweetener. So, I found this for $2. Don't know if that's a good price or not, but I will be looking it up. I'm pretty sure it probably is. Um, but this is... I know it says keto, I'm not keto, but I am diabetic, and I use a lot of sugar in my coffee, so 
if this works and I can keep finding it, I will, um, and it's, and if it's at a good price, but by the time you see this, I'll have looked it up already. Um, but if it is, I'm going to try to find some more and stock it up so I can maybe try to get myself off of additional sugar. I know I'm saying that and I got a whole bunch of sugar stuff here. <laughs> Sorry y'all, I'm trying, but, um, I still have my own weaknesses. So... I'm working on it, um, the best I can, actually. Um, Mandarin oranges for $1.50, uh, there's a, a one, and I re, I try to, I try to reuse the container, even though it's plastic. I would prefer it's in glass, but I do what I can. And then they had a whole bunch of blueberry jelly. They don't usually have blueberry jelly, and I'm going to be putting this stuff away it was marked two for a dollar and then I also love using these jars um, so I'm trying to get more of these jars too so that maybe I could do something with them but um, they had it marked for the birds um, but she said that was just like a, a saying that they were doing so I don't know they were marked a dollar I picked up uh, Let's see, I think, well, I got two in here right now, but I think I picked up four because I was kind of excited about it. And then I have never tried either, oh, I didn't realize I picked up both the same. They were supposed to be different. Um, I've never tried oat milk chocolate before, and again, this is something I'm just going to try with my friend. We were just going to have a couple of pieces off of one bar. So this will last me quite a while. I might even vacuum seal one of them if I like it. I'll vacuum seal the other one and put that away into my morale preps or morale booster preps. So, um, yeah, like I said, I have an addiction to sugar. I know that it's not good for me, but it is what it is. And if I can try to get myself to um, limit myself as I work on getting myself off of it, it's just better in the long run. Um, I did pick up some Super Coffee Positive Energy um, Caramel Latte. I picked up, um, and they are two for three, so I picked up two just for something different. Um, once in a while, I'm going to probably have one maybe tomorrow morning. Oh, here's the other corn in the cob. Um, same one as the other one. Um, I did find, I know it's got a dent, so I'll be using this pretty soon. They had it for three for two. Focus if I put my hand further away. Um, for the sausage gravy. Um, so it came out to be less than a dollar because I only could find one. And it's dented, but I will be using this one fairly soon. I did pick up two of the tahini. Because I love this stuff. And I will... Possibly trying to... Um, I'll probably vacuum seal one of these to see how it goes. Because um, I have two of them. So I got two right there. The other... Um, two, str uh, two blueberry jellies are in there. Which that will go into my... Uh, jelly preps I have um, in my food supply and then sliced peaches um, again when I get done with them I'll use the container for something anything else other than those two jars nope that is it everybody um, so oh yeah I donated s some change to the um, guy can't, uh, can't remember who, what he was doing, what organization he was doing it for. But I'm sure by seeing the Tootsie Roll, y'all probably know who does it. Um, anyways, I donated some change that I had to him, and he gave me a Tootsie Roll. He also helped me because I dropped one of my juices, <laughs> and my hands were full, my arms were full, so he picked it up for me. So I was very grateful. So that's just some stuff that is, some of them is going to get 
put away for later, but most of it's just going to be consumed over the next day, weeks kind of thing. Or, you know, month. I don't know. However long it takes me to get through it. Um, and the sweets will be paced out. They'll be paced out for quite a while. Um, like I said, if my friend comes over tomorrow, like she says she might, um, we might have a few pieces. So they'll go a little bit quicker. But I'll stretch them out, um, obviously. So all right, everybody. Have a great day. May God bless each and every one of you to overflowing. And may he keep you, your friends, and family safe. Bye for now.